Sadie thinks you're going bye-bye. We should really enjoy these little times together. I thought that crash would have been the last of you. If we hadn't been lucky, you just might have gotten your wish. You can let her go now and save yourself some pain. Or we can break you first. It's your call. Sorry to be a bore, but let's say I refuse both of those. I'd be happy to decide for you. The princess was splendid. Her power equals the ancient children of the full moon. Every person has a role, and the princess has played her part exceedingly well. If she's done her part, then we'll take her back right now. As you wish. Princess now. Her power has subsumed her will entirely. Her power has finally been controlled by a system I have put into place. Blastia that go out of control must be destroyed. You should know that. Don't talk about Estelle like she's just some thing. Oh, but the princess was a tool most crucial to my plans. As were you, Schwan. And since you survived, I will use you again. Return like the puppet you are. 
Sorry, but you buried that poor schmuck alive yourself. I'm Raven. Pleased to meet you. We all have a role to play, but each person has a say in what that role is. Even though so many live such meaningless mundane lives? I think not. If they choose that life, then so what? That's what deciding for yourself means. How unfortunate. We will never see eye to eye. No! Estelle, don't do this! Damn it! Perhaps that was not enough power. Thanks to you, this new key to replace Dane Nomos is now complete. As a show of my appreciation, I will allow you to witness the fruition of my plan. The awakening of the true child of the full moon. The enduring shrine of Zaude. The ultimate Blastia, which once obliterated the catastrophe that threatened our world. That's a Blastia? Maybe you could save this little speech until you get some alone time. You're embarrassing yourself. The show, I am afraid, is over. It is time for the final curtain. Now. Princess, do your friends the favor of separating their heads from their bodies. Bastard! None of this would have happened if you hadn't insisted on coming here. Oh, how the poor girl will feel when she comes to her senses. 
farewell. Damn you, Alexei, wait! Get back here! Alexei! Estelle, don't! Please. Before I can hurt anyone else, please. Set you free. Yuri! Yuri! What the hell do you think you're doing? I... I... No! No more, please! Do you really plan to die here? You think it's okay to die? Ah! Look me in the eye! Estelle! Estelle, snap out of it! Come back to us! Estelle! Ah. Are you just gonna let your life end like this? Like someone else's tool?
You did it, Estelle! You're you again! Wait! The system! It was being kept in check by Alexei's sword. Without that... Uh, ah! Ah! I can't... I can't stop it now! Everyone, run! Don't worry! We're not gonna lose you! Rita, it's up to you! Amazing! It's synchronized with Estelle. Interference deactivation data. A formula to isolate surplus air. But what could possibly take the place of the Apatheia? What about this sword? This is the original that Alexei based his on, right? Let me try it. Let me help. I'll keep track of the flow of air. Me too! Oh, damn this useless body. Please! Everyone! What did I say? We're not gonna lose you. When Brave Asperia does something, we do it right. Okay. Welcome back. Nice to be back. The Enduring Shrine of Zaude. That's what he said. Have you heard of it? No, that's the first time. I wonder what it is. I don't know, but I know what he's gonna use it for. World domination. Do you really think he can do that? He sure thought he could. We knights are always one step behind. Without the rest of you, we'd never have been able to approach the capital, much less stop the Blastia from spreading this danger across the land. It was the knights that protected the capital from Heracles, though. Even with Lady Esteles. Hey, Estelle came back on her own. Alexei owes the world for all he's done. He owes us. Tomorrow, I'm going to the Shrine of Zaude. I assume your friends will be with you. Yeah, everyone's resting up for tomorrow. So spare me any guilt trips tonight. Okay. Captain, so this is where you were. <sighs> you again. Negotiations with the Union are difficult. It seems they can't even agree with each other. And one more thing. The Council intends to cede all authority to His Highness Yoder in order to control the current crisis. Due to your success in liberating the capital, His Highness has pronounced you Acting Commandant. Congratulations! Well, this cleans up one of our problems. Congrats. Watch your tone! Yuri, you're the one who really did all this. Ah, details, details, whatever. Well, I guess I'll go check on the others. See ya.